Hello guys and welcome to this video which is a pretty much pretty basically is all I can say it as um, recently rolled over 100 subs I believe right now my anna, my YouTube creator app and my YouTube and the YouTube app are having a argument over what is actually correct versus 112 or 113 either way that's a pretty decent milestone that i didn't actually think we would ever actually hit or even come anywhere close to hitting now a lot of people probably say that but that was an honest thing i mean i never thought this would actually take off in a pretty decent set so what i kind of figured i would do excuse me japanese ain't sitting right or something like that <coughs> is do a meet the gamer pretty much meet or like we talk about you know i give you some background on me and the channel and how where it started and kind of like where we're going okay and i think the first place we'll start there is probably my gamer tag which is tb the dragon now the first the first letter is my first name the second letter is obviously my last name of course my first name as you all know is tommy and B is my last name. I'm going to keep that guys from you still. I'm going to keep that from you. 50 likes, or not 50 likes, God, hell. But I've never got a video to have 10. We get 10 likes, I'll tell you the last name. I'll do it in the chat, so you're going to have to watch the video for that. Um, and then Dragon. Um, little, well, probably not a little known fact or an underscore fact that if you do watch some of the videos, you'll hear me and Richard talking that. I am a furry, at least a little bit, and that's where the dragon portion comes in. Now, before you all start losing your heads, no, I don't have a suit, never attended any of those um, cons because no money. I barely got enough money to keep this, this setup running. Like, I'm using a Blue Yeti microphone, I got a 19-inch tiny TV on a big, on a $78 desk with a $350 HP um, custom built on a custom built a laptop that was pre built by uh, Computer Kings, not sponsored, nothing. But I bought this a year ago and I'm sitting in a nine year old rocking chair that, or no, 15 year rocking chair that was actually was bought so I my mother could rock my sister to sleep, which has definitely seen a lot of action. but is now my gamer chair. So, I mean, this is literally the setup. Nothing fancy, nothing here. Um, and the idea behind why I made the channel was I wanted to go to college and make video games. Money didn't ever turn out right, so now I'm working the dead end, or not the dead end, but 40 hour job. This one says it's not dead end. They all are, let's be honest. But that's what this is. So, working 40 hours a week, it's kind of hard to hook up with everybody and all my friends. So, plus the internet out here in West Virginia, which is where I live in the mountains, is absolutely atrocious. Like, I get 3 megabits and Andrew lives probably 4 or 5 miles as a crow flies across the highway from me. can get like 25. Because they won't come out because I'm sitting in between a lower mountain, a middle mountain, and the upper mountain. And I live on top of the middle mountain. Which, if you think about it, a satellite should be speeding, um, beamed down from space. Or at least as I understand it. So, there's never really a set um, upload schedule. Because I don't know if I'm ever going to come home and see an error message that all oh, the video timed out. Or uh, your internet connection got cut for five seconds because we had a tree branch hit a damn phone line. At least it's not dialed. At least, it's, at least it's not that. But that's what this is. And growing up, my family is very basic. They're not very technologically advanced people, to put it this way. At least my parents aren't. So the best I ever had was an old um, desktop to play games on. And those games were like mini, mini clip and the candy stand, I think is what they were, online. Because it was just a basic office uh, desktop 
HP office or some crap. I mean, just basically built for work. That's all it was doing. All it was for. And you can't run a whole lot. So it took my first job to actually buy my Xbox. And the Xbox is pretty much where now the magic happens. They really created it for me. And growing up, not having all this, you know, you see all your friends that have these games, you go to your house and play them, but then you come home and you're like, I can't even think about playing those because, one, I can't afford the games. Two, I ain't got a system playing them on. And, you know, you ain't got the internet to even think about trying to play those most of the time without lagging your ass off. So, you're kind of left with, well, what do I do? And, gloriously, YouTube came along and everyone started uploading videos of games. So, now you're just kind of, like, left with, well, hey, now I can at least watch the games that I can't play. But I can at least watch them. So, that way, you know, I can at least keep up with the conversations at school and whatnot. Of course, I started a YouTube channel when I was out of school. But, that's kind of what the game was, or my channel was built on was single player games, well I can't say what I'm trying to build it because we're still definitely under construction. Definitely under construction still. And then as I progressed, I mean I knew it was gonna be me and Andrew, but I never imagined I'd meet Richard or Kai or Dragon along the way. That would be like, hey, we want a game with you and hey, we're awesome. We want to be in the video. So this is where the video or the channel started kind of going more to the multiplayer. Let's try to get everybody together. Which is kind of where the channels were building a lot of steam, but for me it seems like the channel kind of got lost, or what my idea was. The idea was I can make videos of games that have story mode because there's, you know, there's a lot of people that were like me that can't buy those games or buy the console and don't get the chance to play them if they don't go to their friend's house and whatnot, so that way they can be like, Hey, I can watch that, which I understand a lot of people do that, but a lot of those have commentary, which is why I don't have uh, commentary in my story games. Which I'm going to actually start playing now, so that way the background doesn't fall asleep. Yeah, yeah. I started over. This one had that skyline on it, but it'll be all right. The skyline's dead. We now got a Mustang with an inline 4. They need to work on it. <laughs> but anyway, that's what the channel was kind of built on now when i said the channel's caught and kind of lost it's we're just all doing you know all the multiplayer but then again not a lot of big single player games have really been made out recently you know so that's kind of where it is but so i can't exactly say i've lost the focus it's just more like hey we got it now and a lot of channels like that but it's not where i want the channel to go is to the multiplayer thing, which is kind of where we're sitting, but it's not bad. But I can play single player games like this, like right now on the channel, this series, Super Street, is like the most watched um, series that I have going right now between the Subaru and the Golf. Like they're getting almost 40 videos, and I thank you guys for this, because I love my racing games. I love my arcade racing games. I love them to death. Whee. And, of course, neat. I've learned the hard way about music with copyrights with a couple of videos and just not good. But, like I said, I started this with not really looking into it, but just, you know, the thought of how I want to do it. So, you know, mistakes will happen and I apologize to those. But, Need for Speed was an honest to good where I wanted to start. And I did start with 2015, but I had to get rid of every single one of those. All those got it, and if they didn't, I just went ahead and took them down. So, those don't exist. But, Need for Speed hasn't quite gotten to the part, or back to its glory day, I should say. Like most one in the carbon. It's getting there, but it's not. Which is where I wanted to do. Plus, I'm figuring out how to add music into the background through, um... YouTube, which is now letting me do this, which is why I kind of boosted my game audio and my microphone settings because on the videos I tried to edit, everything was too low, and no matter how much I had it set to one way, it still had it um, too much towards the music, and that's all you could hear. 
So now that the video or the audio has gotten louder, if I were to do it, you know, you could at least have some background in music. <clears throat> but that's kind of where the channel is eventually going to go back to. I mean, I'm not going to stop playing with my friends, and I'm not going to stop uploading with those. But the reason I'm... Dear God, I ate the car. The car's gone. Very weak car, but whatever. Anyway, um, well, as meaning by the channel is kind of lost the direction is, it's not so much of I don't want to play with the friends. That's not even the closest case. It was more of what I was thinking, you know, rushing in like, oh my God, I got to get a new microphone because I sound like crap with the multiplayer, or I need to get new um, recording software so that way I can do like um, funny moments and all those, which those honestly do good on YouTube. But it's not the point of my channel or what I wanted my channel to be. My channel was to be to play those games, to have those stories, because all those, um, for you know, all those people that couldn't watch them, could. Which there's a lot of other people that do it, and you gotta, you know, separate yourself from it. And the way I wanted to separate myself from that was no audio through the single player campaign, camp, campaign, campaign. Because most of those videos you saw, and if you're trying to sit there and watch a cutscene and they're talking over and don't have subtitles on, you're like, what the hell did he just say? Or like, what's going on? What did he just say? What the hell is happening in the video? You miss that information because the dude won't shut up. But a game like this is doesn't have a story. doesn't even really have a career. So it's just kind of like, I get to have him talk to you guys with it. And the fact that it's doing amazing on the channel makes you go, yes, racing is not dead. It's so much better. So, but like I, but like this year, I don't think a lot of multiplayer, or not multiplayer, but um, single player games did come out. I mean, Tube Raiders out, which I'll get to. I'll get there eventually. Um, I think that was a Ubisoft game. Ubisoft's okay with you doing stuff. So, uploading. So, yeah, eventually get it. Um, Resident Evil, we actually have, me and Kai have something planned for Resident Evil 6. A co-op thing for, um, um... Halloween because we've done Dead by Daylight enough times that it's not quite where I want to be for the spooky and not a lot of horror games have multiplayer not a lot of those the asymmetrical horror games are just now starting to come on they're, they're starting to become big so we'll be seeing more of those in the future which I'm kind of excited for uh, whenever Death Garden releases for the Xbox I'm definitely going to get it but I mean of course, Spyro is going to be a big, and has been a big staple. It's still my most watched video is my Dragon Challenges. Like, this this series is good, doing great, fantastic. But, the Legend series, which is still what I think the better Spyro, hate me in the comment section. But, I still prefer Legends over that, but you better damn well believe that eventually, whenever it finally freaking launches, you will be able to find it on my channel, and my voice will not be saying a damn thing. Will the music be turned off? More than likely. I don't know. Spire, the Legend of Spire series music never has been attacked or been mentioned or anything like that that I've noticed. Because all my videos are still there and still floating around. But with this game being new and coming out, I'm probably not going to. But I'm not going to have me talking over it because that still ruins the experience. So I'll probably have some little weird background music. I'll find something from YouTube or some app or something. I'll figure something out. But back to what I was meaning about the channel's kind of lost its focus. The multiplayer games are not going anywhere. Me and my friends aren't going anywhere. It's just I'm going to be taking kind of like a little, not a break so much, but more like a mental, I don't need to buy this because this isn't what my channel's going to be focused on. Is oh my god, i got to have the mic, or my god, i got to do this so I can add all this. That's not what the channel was built on, or what I wanted it for. I know it's not the finish, but just to get them at the line like that was pretty cool kind of cool if that was the finish but it wasn't but oh well and you said he owned this and he said it felt like a boat this doesn't feel like a boat to me it's kind of like a bmw mix with a gtr or uh, not gtr but a ford mustang gt which is the front end we have on it is a ford mustang gt front end andrew i know you'll eventually watch this video and want to comment it's like it's not a mustang it's a bmw mix with a mustang it's more mustang than bmw to me which is why it's probably going to get the bmw uh, V8, uh, four and a half liter V8. Could 
put a Honda Civic VTEC in it. Just absolutely ruin a Mustang or BMW, whichever one you prefer. Just ruin it that way. I don't know. We'll see what this does. But I figured I'd choose this as the background because, yes, Spyro was the star, but this was my favorite. The racing genre was my favorite. They were also the best videos I did, or like, before they got copyrighted, were the most popular videos I did. And this is boasting the same thing again, and I'm like, yes, thank God. But that's pretty much it. Not a whole lot. And, furry, gaming to do soup, or uh, single player campaign games, because, you know, so he could, you know, relive his past, and help, um, you know, give something for the people that can't play or watch them, or not watch, but can't play or, because they don't have the money to actually watch them, you know, to do that, kind of like, I was in that situation, so I want to do the same thing again. So that's pretty much the idea behind the channel. That's pretty much it. Now, we're going to all start with customization on this one. Let's start with this, which we're going to customize this, so don't you worry. Let's go size first. It ticks me off. Like, it's got to go in sequence. It's got to be sequenced. Oof, excuse me. Sequence me. I want this one. Because I'm weird like that. No. 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 Eh. Eh. Is it this one? No. Yeah, I think it was that one. I think we're going with it. I now have six dollars. Might do one more race to see if we can slap a spoiler on it. How much is a spoiler? Might have to do a couple of them. But I mean, as far as, you know, see which one we're going to go with. Subaru? I don't know. Car Speed? I don't know. Why is it black? I didn't know this one had a black one. That's weird. <laughs> no. 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 No again. No. Not too angled. Now, the other ones are too much angled. Now, these ones just are like way too much angle. It's like, holy crap. Tiny little thing. Got a custom big fat fatty. I thought they had a little wing. A little wing. I'm not running that. That does not fit the car. That's like weirdly out of proportion. Maybe that's something to work with. Like, get, get some... Get, get, get something on that. Guess I'm gonna have to probably run that one. And that is $750. And we'll save that for the next time we run the Mustang. Or I might just take a, keep a spoiler off of it. Anyway, guys, that's pretty much what this video is. Just, you know, meet the gamer. Meet me. Now, I love you all, and I thank you guys for helping me get to 100. I thank you, Dragon, Kai, Andrew, Richard, for playing with me. And don't worry, you guys are not going anywhere. This is not the end. It's definitely the beginning. But we're going to slowly shift. And I'll shift. It's going to be kind of like a mesh-up of half and half. You know, just to keep the channel alive and accurate. But we're definitely going to be working on trying to find some single-player games to go back to where I had the original idea for the channel roll. But as for this video, it's wrapped up, and I thank you all. Dragon Mountain Gaming, TV the Dragon, catch you in the next one.